No, my balloon, my balloon! My balloons! Fuck. What's goody, everyone? Welcome back to the Silver and Gold Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. I am your host, of course, JRuff, and what's goody? Uh, in the last episode, we climbed to the top of the Butter Building, and it seems now we're in a land in the sky, in the Grape Garden. I don't know how many grapes are up in the sky, but you know what? It is what it is. Um, just grateful, just grateful to be here on this in this day um, in in history. Uh, we're gonna jump in here really quick before we get started, just to get some lives. Another tie. Another tie! Oh my god! Fuck! <laughs> oh, and I didn't even get up getting fucking any kind of lives. Oh well. What sucks is that DDD's not the last one, so... Well, oh well. Let's just head into level 3. Oh, which has this great theme music that sounds just very odd. And right off the bat, we kind of have a new gimmick here. A cannon! You light it on fire. It's pretty much the easiest example of a cannon that you can actually get very easily. Easy, easy, easy. It gives you a 1-up. So there we go, we got a 1-up there. Um, there are going to be other instances where you're going to need to get a cannon like that to get some sort of secret, perhaps. I hit the D. That's me hitting the D. Or I guess, well, it's A, technically, for for people actually playing on a Game Boy. I don't want to bother some people that I'm playing on an emulator because I do legitimately have the game and I meant to put in an image of the game. So let me put in, in the image of me with said game in my possession, because that's 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 the truth. I would not fib on such a highest caliber. Um seems like this place goes on for a bit, but there's a door back there. Oh no, mate, maybe I should have just I should have just went for the door, because it's gonna be hard to go back now. So perhaps that door was the secret. Eh, it's not as hard now. Alright, let's see. Um, we got purple teleporting kaboos. And, aha, okay, I see what this is. You're supposed to think, like, how am I supposed to get that? But alas, it's in your ass. See, Kirby, like, secrets in these... Wait, is this even... You can just stand? Okay. Oh, well, and then I'm gonna fall into the one spot there's a gap. Fuck it, I don't even want that one anyway. Get in there. Alright, well this seems to be an area of which we're supposed to be heading. It's weird because we're, we're just sitting getting like airships and shit for a bit now, but like, it's not like Mario where this would be like the end of the level, or like the end of the game, or like the end of some shit. The climactic battle. There's none of this. This is just another day for Kirby. Another day we just cause a huge explosion that does no damage to anything in the surrounding area, just the enemies. Grab on that warp star! Kirby warp star! And hopefully this laser will help us. I don't know how we're gonna be angling laser stuff around here. Forget, I, I guess I forget how often laser was an ability in this game. And I think I missed another secret. But that's okay, because we can be number three, and that's the third time in the third level that we missed a secret, right? Yes, indeed, unfortunately. Alright, so we're gonna have to go back to two levels now. It's, I guess, a revolving door. What, what can we get in here, though? Ah, Bugsy! We can get the suplex, it's actually the namesake, not the namesake, but the main power illustrated on the cover of this game, or at least the cartridge. I believe it's on the cover, too. I don't know what I did with my cover of the game. And it's okay if he hurts us, as long as he doesn't kill us, because we get a maximum tomato for our victory. And now I can suplex you to the oblivions. Alright, now why don't we go in number four right here. And we got this cool 
I'm sorry, but this is like kind of like a a, a theme where I would be like a, like a heavy set like dancing villain character would show up or something like that. Like when you when you talk about the fuck 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 fuck. No, I'm gonna get that. Okay. That fucking the thing that Kanye West put in that one song that he took Kid Cudi off of, but then put Kid Cudi back on. Is it remote control? That's that's. The thing that he put at the end, the glub glub jabula. But this is like the song when I when I when I see that thing. This is the song I'd imagine it would be singing. And I almost just offed my silly willy self right there. The only thing about the the suplex thing is if you haven't mastered it or at least haven't practiced using it in a while, it's a little unwieldy when you just go off into the distance. So you gotta remember it's like a boost. As well, you can't. These fucking quack ducks! No! 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 Alright, whatever. Yeah, fuck off. I, I, I'm I smarter than a fifth grader. Wheelie, I could use you. You make me impervious to everything, right? Hello, invisible wall, I can't see. Oh, okay. Here, this time, we're gonna have to race this thing. Not race this thing! Oh, fuck, I fucked up already. God damn it. I already fucking. I already failed it. Well, that's another secret we missed. God damn it. How did I fuck it up? Alright, wait. Maybe it'll restart us here so we can start again at the top. Also, I don't want to lose my life, though. It might not be there. What did I do that so effortlessly fucked it up? Alright, we got another chance. Oh, no. Oh, no, we have to turn it. Wait, what? Oh, no, no, no. I get it. I got it now. Fuck. Um, I don't know if we'll start back at level one. You know what? It's fine. I can do that. I know that I know how to do this now. So if I ever need to do this, I'll just do it at one point. So that's three things we're gonna have to probably go back for, unless it was just for like an extra life. In which case, that would be a lot of extra effort for just a fucking extra life. Nope, it was an extra life and a secret. All right, we'll we'll go back and get that later. Just a lot of, a lot of shit saved for later then. Oh hey, it's another person that has a certain ability that I want to see. Okay, if I die now, I'm not gonna go back, so fuck, alright, whatever. I think I might just I might just Most of these bosses are honestly better fought, like their normal ways. Unless you have like such a great ranged attack that you don't have to get fucked up by. This is an elephant thing with two legs. I don't know why it's got two legs. And I've always, and to tell you the truth, I never knew the name of this fucking thing, so I'm not gonna pretend to know what it is now. You just gotta s spit apples back at it when it spits them at you, and you get the throw ability. This is what I was looking for, not the suplex. Basically, instead of sucking enemies in and taking their abilities, you just throw them, and of course, it looks like it. You're as you're meant to have this here. So hey, if you didn't, if you didn't, if you got that secret, now if you did get the secret, it probably would have taken you this way anyway. Um, I was gonna say you might not have gotten this ability. All right, now now this is kind of Ed. All right, there we go, and there we go. We ended the level right there. And I knew I got that one at the moment. I know they hit that at the very peak. So at least you get a level up or a level one, a one up. Excuse me. Put it up, up, up. And hey, we can go back there anytime we want. That's pretty nice. And obviously, wait, what? What? So then, what was that door for? Was it just the one up? There had to have been something else there. Whatever. Maybe I'll look look at that, perhaps just just to see what that what, what that was. And I did say I could do it. All right, but now we got crazy crazy epic Kirby time. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Uh, I should mention, because I haven't really mentioned it, but most of these enemies here are, uh, what do you call it, are minions of King DDD. However, the guys with swords are not. The guys with swords are mi minions of Meta Knight, if I believe correctly, because they all have knight in their name, like Blade Knight and something knight. I think that's Blade Knight, I'm, I'm not too sure. Oh, no! Oh, oh, oh. He's hitting the wrong button. Not a good idea. Alright, I believe we have a mini boss coming up. Or just a weird looking door. Um, where do I get the feeling we're gonna wanna have a sword here? 
Yep, exactly. You see a lot of the sword fuckers around, but I can suplex you and I can take out multiple of you at once. Or I could just do that. Oh, oh, no, no, give me that back. My good ability, I don't want your no ability having asses. Okay, come on with these fucking thick clouds. Ah, there we go. Ripping sick thick clouds. I'm gonna rip some sick thicks. Some thickersons. Some thicker. There we go. What I've been should have been doing this entire time. Where's the music continued? All right, now throw your civil silver and gold ass in the garbage. And what do we got here? Just a just a nice wall and something that fell off. Just a oh, what the fuck are these? I was gonna say bees. All right, whatever. Suplex Kirby gone. Why do I get the feeling I need a burning bull? We'll take spark for now. Cause we just love putting that here. Oh, I want to get burning man. Still haven't combined power ups yet. Cause yeah, I get the feeling that we're gonna need this. And why do I get the feeling we can go? You know what? Wait. I know that the reason why you're here is so I can go through, or I could just go through like. I don't think I was touching that, but whatever. It was just for a life. That's that's stink, stink McPooper. Please don't. And he's gonna respawn. Yep, of course. All right. Well, I, I meant to land. Oh. All right, hold on. I'm trying to land right next. To... There's no room. Where is the ledge? There's like no nothing that indicates that where the ledge is because you wanna you're gonna wanna go. Okay. There we go. And then this fuckhead's gonna come. Alright, whatever. Maybe there's a secret this way. No! No! Oh my god! This is game! Fuck it, fuck it, taking hits, taking hits. Oh, it was just a shortcut to the end. Whatever. And I got a one-up again, so you know what? Fuck you, I didn't need any of it. I didn't need any of it! Alright, well, with another secret gotten, why don't we do the reasonable thing? And why don't we go level 6, I believe the highest that we've gone so far. And we get the butter building music back again. Even though we're not in butter building, but we're in a very big abandoned mansion thing. Alright, well unfortunately I can't get that, that, that sword man over there. But who says Kirby the Forgotten Land was the first time Kirby went to some abandoned apocalypse area-ish. Um, I would like you... No, I would not like to kick. I would like to use the sword. I don't know why. This fucking music makes me compelled to sing. I don't know why. Um, actually, I think I might be compelled to get you instead. And of course, that fucking star is gonna go over there. Can you go away from me, please? And, by, and I was talking to the water there. Alright. You can go on fire, and you can not... Hey, it's a blue clock guy. You ever get sick of these bosses? Because they, they use they tend to use the same ones in every Kirby game, I've noticed, or at least variations of them. I'm good. I don't need no stinking mic. Oh yeah, I gave him a mic check. Come on. Up when we got happy fat man music again. But I just lost my fire, and that's gonna go over there and get inspired. Wait, what? This is this is actually an ability? Oh! Oh, that's what it does. So interesting. I didn't... I... Wow, okay. I, I forgot that that was even a thing. So there you go. Probably people were screaming at the camera... The, the camera. Screaming at the screen, being like, Hey, um... You know, you should, uh... You should maybe put that light on, because you can. I think I had an ability last time, though, so... Might not have worked. Uh, back to whatever the fuck this location is supposed to be. I guess we've been through all that already. Oh, and we got time to get stumped. So another use for the stone ability is you can do that. 
Which one of these do we want, though? Um, I don't know what that was for. Huh? I'm so confused at that. Wait, were we supposed to- is this it? Wait, what? Oh, okay, what? Alright. I forgot these guys had alternate, like, attires and whatever. I should have taken the health, but it's fine. Like, I forgot the enemies have different colors and shit. I guess it's more easy to see on a bigger screen that I'm playing on right now. Um, and it looks like we missed yet another fucking secret. So now, um, we're gonna go face the boss, and then after the boss, we're gonna come back here and then take care of all of the secret stuff. Okay? Uh, you know what? Actually, maybe before the boss would be a better idea, so why don't we go take care of that now? Alright, so first, let's start with level one. Alright, let's, let's try again. Look at me, I have the best power-up in the game! So if you recall, I said we needed to come back here as UFO Kirby. Actually, what I didn't remember, and what I actually remember doing as a kid, what you need to do is just go up, because it's just a fucking door. And I thought it was like I needed to charge this up and shoot that at that location. No, because me as a kid was obviously smarter and didn't need to have to do that. But I, my old ass dumbass self, needed to look up a guide, like an idiot. So, with that taken care of, now, since we've already beaten this level, we can just leave through the door. Unfortunately, we don't get to take our power up with us, but now we get to show off another bomb level. So let's do that. I don't think anything about it changes, maybe it gets a little bit more challenging. I feel like they changed spots. Alright, can I not die with the first, like, fucking attempt? I- It's either too early or too late, there's no in-between! I can't win! I cannot win! Fuck. What sucks is that I was always, like, I liked being, like, good at that. It's very prideful when you actually do good at that. Alright, well, let's get this one now. Alright, if what I am to be believed is true, we must go to the bottom right area of this entire area. And there's a door, which we, I believe we missed last time we were over here. Yep. Because we chose the door and there was, I believe, no way of going back. So why don't we go in here? Come on. And there's another button! And we get another ability. That's pretty nice. Alright, let's see what that ability is. And now this time we get to keep our ability? Why couldn't we keep the fucking UFO? What is that? That's fu a fucking chip! What is that? Oh, it's sleep and ball. Alright, well I guess we can show what ball is now. But I never knew how to use this. Basically, you turn into a ball. You can bounce off the walls and go really fast. There's a way of, like, controlling how you bounce. Oh, I guess I guess I just figured it out. You have to, like, move yourself up and down, sort of. Smarter men, smarter men than I, or, or women, uh, probably more women than men, honestly, can figure out how to do this better than I. And wait, why is it... Why does Ball Kirby just look nothing like what he looks like? Like, why has he got blonde hair and the Japanese and American flags? What? What is all that about? But also, you have to actually gain momentum as the ball in order to be able to injure people. So you're going to want to take note of that. And now, finally. Jeez, I'm, I'm going to get rid of this. This first instance, I get the chance. Which is right now. Alright, and finally, let's go to number six. Oh, shit! Where are these things fucking coming from? They're everywhere! They're everywhere! Alright, ah! You wanna use this? Can this kill every enemy on the screen? God, what the fuck? Those fucking flies! They were just after me! I remember it being like that. Alright, before we get a game over, you're gonna wanna get this. And then go back, I believe. Fucking shit. There's a door here. There it has the button. There you go. And it's just a warp star. They risked my goddamn life for a warp star. Alright, now we're gonna leave the door. But that warp star might actually be something we might want to use. Um, but I don't think we need it right now. Um, for now, I think our best bet is to just head inside and fight the boss of this area. 
I was gonna say we don't need to find the warp star because I was gonna use this. So this is Cracko, and I, of course I fucked that up. Come on, give me that. Cracko is the thick puffy cloud that I was referring to earlier, or at least subtly hinting towards. Uh, Cracko is one of the more, at least one of my more annoying Kirby arch rivals of sorts. I always used to have shit. Uh, Cracko used to always give me shit. And it's giving me shit right now! Oh! Fuck! I hit the button, you son of a munch! And there we have our first game over. But at least we get to see this scene where fucking Master Hand pushes Kirby on. Okay, but where will this start us at? Okay, thankfully it doesn't take us take away anything we've done. I thought it might, but there we go. We just lost a few points. So the way you're supposed to do this is you're just supposed to keep going up. But obviously the AI rubber band's like a motherfucker, so he's gonna be able to catch up with you. But as long as you use the high jump and you don't get hit by him, at least on the ground, you should be fine, although it's very hard to see since that UI is at the bottom, where the fuck he is, or where there's actually ground. There's plenty of these high jump guys that you will be running into. And there, I thought I could have died. I think we hit the point where, yep, we're at the second phase of this boss, where he becomes his cloud form. His thick, wavy cloud, and I definitely hit him there. I guess that's the thing of playing this on a keyboard. It is very... I wouldn't say very delayed, but the reaction timing is a bit delayed. That's why I am not able to beat the quick draw, or I'm not able to get the timing right on the bomb. Although it could just be my ability, you know? It could just be that. I, I'm not the best. I'm not perfect. Alright, well, that's unfortunate, because we needed to throw an enemy at us. I think I'm gonna die. Oh wow, that's surprising. Alright, Krakow, is, as I said, is one of my more... Uh, harder enemies to fight, and there we go, we got him. At least when I was a kid, he was probably my least favorite boss. But, I love the familiarity with these Kirby enemies, and I gotta say, I've grown a soft spot to the Cracko Man. Alright, and now we're in the yogurt yard, and I love this music. I believe we've heard it before, though. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
Here's the door. We didn't actually need the down thing to actually get to it. And there we go. Alright, and you know what? Just for shits and giggles, let's try that bomb thing. And maybe we can get it once before the video ends. Hey! Hey, we got one, ladies and gentlemen! We got one! And he turns into one of those balls! Oh, no! Oh, alright. We got a one-up, and on that note, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. Peace. Too bad we lose all these lives whenever we start the game again. Alright, well, that's done with that, but now we have probably, so far, one of my favorite bosses so far in this game. We have, uh, I forget the names. Twyla? No, I think I'm talking, I think I'm thinking of the Sun and the Moon from Mario, uh, Party 6. Alright, well, unfortunately, we don't have anything to fight them with, which I probably should have came in with a power up. Um, but it's fine. Oh, no, it's not. So, yeah, but in this boss fight, it's cool because the sun and the moon work together to fuck you up. Uh, it's much easier to avoid the, the sun's power than the moon's, because the moon's just very...